Hey, what's up, everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to export a uh, freeze frame from iMovie. Uh, a lot of times, I'll kind of take a video of things. For instance, uh, it's just kind of two dogs playing. They're just playing here, and uh, and I'll put it in slow motion, and that way I can kind of get the best pictures. And I'll go ahead and just add freeze frame, and then I can have that as a picture. In these cases, I have got these out of just these clips right here this one's kind of funny this one's kind of cool too um, now there's a couple way to do this first off I'll show you kind of like the easiest way I just kind of set all these on two seconds it doesn't matter uh, you're just gonna want to be able to take a screenshot so I'll just go ahead and blow it up full screen and I'm gonna com uh, push command shift 3 and it will take a picture take a picture take a picture and take a picture so I've got those now and those will actually save these will save to my desktop go ahead and show you here and you can actually then drag those to edit into iPhoto that would be the first way and probably the easiest way the second way is a little more difficult you're gonna want to go back into iMovie and in this case you kind of see what I'm talking about here in a second say I want this this photo only I'm gonna have to delete everything else give me one second here so I'm just gonna go ahead and I'll delete all this delete this and that's the picture I want so I'll delete that delete these so now we just have this picture here and it really only needs to be like 0.5 seconds it's just going to take longer to actually export if it's any longer. So now I just have a 0.5 second clip here. It's just a freeze frame. I'm going to go up to share, export using QuickTime. And you're going to want to name it. I'm just going to say dogs playing. And you're going to want to use on here where it says export movie to image sequence. And you can just use default settings, and I'll just hit save. It will export. Like I said, the shorter you make the actual picture, the shorter it will be. And now, you see here, Dogs Playing is on my desktop. And I will drag that into iPhoto. And there is for me to crop and uh, just to kind of do whatever else I would like. So that's how to export a still frame in iPhoto, and thank you for watching.